us with us this morning. Colburn actually bailed way off into some good ground. Um, so hopefully they're getting on some this morning. But uh, we've heard a lot of bugles and we're in the same spot. We heard a ton last night. Um, so hopefully we can work something up onto, up onto where we are. But it's only been light maybe 15, 20 minutes. So they're talking this morning, it's super cold, 37 degrees, so I'm pretty excited. So, we have one responding within 200 yards of us right now. He was down this bottom and he's working up over here. Jonathan's now dropping back. Um, that last bugle was crisp and clear. I mean, he might be, he's probably right at 200 right there. Let's see what happens. This is the closest we've been. down in the bottom and uh, I guess we didn't mention is this is a private chunk and we cannot hunt over there on the public side with my tag so we've been hopefully trying to draw them out of the public onto the private which is kind of reversed of what you usually want to do uh, so it's just kind of weird weird deal but uh, we, they're just in this dark timber down on the bottom and I'm pretty sure they bedded down with some cows and stuff so we're gonna back on out of here maybe see if something something's on the other side um, if not we'll get after it again this afternoon at least we heard a bunch we had it heard like 50 plus bugles yeah yeah
Some meat or some horns? No horns. So you y'all follow them way down there. Well, this is what happened. So we literally we get up top first thing in the morning and we're like, oh my stars. They are literally everywhere. There were 13 bulls bugling. Like literally they were one would start, one would start, one would start, one would start. It was, it was pretty epic. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was best day out kind of ever had. Really? Yeah. No way. Yeah. That many bulls. Like it was just, it was that ridiculous. It was bull after bull after bull. Okay hey everyone, that is a wrap for Colorado. We're on the road, we've actually been on the road for a very long time. Uh, we're almost into Nebraska, which is our next stop. But um, Colorado is super awesome. I mean, super awesome to hang out with the guys. Uh, they both still, Coburn and Jonathan, shop off some bulls. And uh, it was my first experience elk hunting, so, you know, tons of positives out of the trip. It stinks I didn't shoot one, but it's not the end of the world. But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching Colorado. Up next is Nebraska. And I am super jacked because Nebraska is probably like my top three favorite states and top three favorite hunts and hunting style of all time. So look forward to it. Catch you guys next time.